Alright, for this first video, I'm going to talk about something which um, really, really bugs me about metal, and that's the use of drum machines. Now, drum machines, they've been around for quite a while, like, you go back to the 90s and, you know, start looking at the early triggers which we used, Fear Factory is a prime example of that really if you listen to the early Fear Factory it's very very much triggered um, but uh, this isn't about triggers um, I don't really have a problem really with triggers um, but drum machines is a different matter really um, now one of the reasons why I love metal so much is because the challenge because of the challenge it is to play. Um, if I sit down and try and play like an indie song, or, well, yeah, indie basically is the most boring form of music for me personally. Um, as a drummer, it's incredibly boring. Um, you know, I, 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 would, I would get so bored and I would lose all interest I have in drumming. Um, but metal always keeps me interested. It keeps it. I'm always happy to improve on my current ability, whether that be in my own band or whether that be by myself or if I'm covering another song. Metal always pushes what I can do, and it's slightly sad and worrying that in modern metal especially in gent um, drum machines have found their place there now I always thought that metal would be the, the genre to say no to that to say no to the to removing the musician should I say um, don't get me wrong I have no problem with electronic music okay I, it has its place. At the end of the day, music is sound, and if that sound moves you, um, it's good music. Uh, however, um, uh, what's happening to metal at the moment is the drummer is being taken out of the equation entirely. Okay, yes. If a band wants to perform live, it needs a drummer. All right, but surely if they can play it live, they can record it. Now, I don't write the guitar tracks in my band because I'm not the guitarist. I write the drum tracks, funny enough, and funny enough, I am the only one who writes the drum tracks. Some of the other members might like to think that they can write the drum tracks, but at the end of the day, I write the drum tracks, and <laughs> that's because I am the drummer, and I play the drums, and I've been playing the drums for quite a while now. But. Um, What worries me is when the guitarist writes the drums and that's as far as it goes. And the record is released without a drummer being involved at all. And what I can do, what a drum machine can't, is groove and feel. Yes, a drum machine is going to be tighter than me it's going to be able to hit the note absolutely bang on dead absolutely of course it will it's mathematics it's computers it's going it's digital it's on or off okay it's hitting that note or it's not hitting the note at all all right so it's going to hit it's going to hit better than me in that respect that doesn't mean 
that it's a better drummer. And listen to almost any gen track. You know, by the, the you get these bands which they're not even bands, they're one guitarist who has called him or herself a band. And they've written a guitar riff and then released um, a record. Uh, which some of them are very good, okay, they are, they're very creative, they're incredibly creative, but it's, um, you know, it's, there's no feel at all from the drums, um, because there's no drummer, it's, it's the hi-hat and the snare sticking to the time signature, with maybe the odd off-hand on the snare, followed by the double bass, basically just following the guitar riff um, and that has its place but it's it's boring and the reason why I listen to metal is because I don't find it boring it's interesting ask anyone what genre of music they like if they say I listen to a bit of everything and then you go metal they go oh no not metal You know, it's, um, it is different. Metal does stand out from other genres. It has its influences, but fundamentally, it is very different. Um, and drummers, if they are good and they can groove and they can feel what they create, is going to be better than what a guitarist can create on a drum machine. That is just like, that's fact. Unless the guitarist is a drummer, in which case that's a different point entirely, um, they should be recording the drums on a drum kit and playing their instrument. Um, but anyway, um, I mean, that's that really. Um, it's just it, it slightly worries me that that is the direction that metal is going in metal should be organic metal should be real instruments metal should be real instrumentalists and vocalists performing because nothing is more exciting than a metal gig most of my friends apart from the ones in my band and the, one I've met, and the ones I've met through my band aren't into metal but you know I've dragged them to gigs I've said come to the gigs come on you'll enjoy it it'd be fun and the, you know and they do they do enjoy it because it's it's so alive there's so much energy in a metal gig but you're not going to get that if you have a guitarist standing on stage and with, with you know a backing track of drums and vocals and bass. Mash it all together and create something amazing. You don't need a computer to do that if you can play your instrument. And believe it or not, guitarists, this is a message for you, there are drummers out there who can do it. You've just got to look hard enough. Just because it's easy or easier, you know, I've never created a drum track, I will admit that, I'm sure it's quite difficult, however, it's, I could probably learn to make a drum track in, I could probably do it in like a day, if not sooner, but, I've been dedicated to my instrument for 15 years. Surely that counts for more than that. Surely playing drums for 15 years counts for more than just, you know, for, for more than just uh, being absolutely bang on all the time. It's not just about that. Create an idea using the drum machine. 
granted but don't just rely on it because there are drummers out there who can do it and can play it and can play it well and can improve on what you have done you know there are moments as a band that we we mesh and we look at each other and we go oh that's that's so good that's sounding so unbelievable and that wouldn't happen if you're sitting in your room with a guitar Um, I'll be making some more videos soon at some point. Um, I'm quite busy, but you know, I find time for things, if I want to do them. So.